Car in action. You want me to play for Mason Bosch tonight? Yeah, we're off to Detroit tomorrow, so the best window we've got. Can you make it by nine? Hello? Uh, yes, I'm um, sorry. Uh... I'll be there. The film's about this character named Arlo who works as a line cook in his father's restaurant. And I think this has always been his father's dream, but it wasn't his. And he always wanted to be a musician, but to follow that dream meant to leave his father's dream behind. So it's, it's this father-son story at its base, but it's really a story about taking that leap and finding what you really want to do with your life. When I read all the fan stories, this one was just kind of jarring because losing your vision is such a life-changing shift. And to find something positive in that moment is just really inspiring to me. And I thought immediately we'd make a really emotional, powerful film. The process of writing the song started with me writing out the lyrics, a couple ideas. I'd written down like a, a bass, very bare bones version of the song. Then I sent it to my friend Logan, who's a musician in Nashville, and he's super talented, and he was able to take what I did and elevate it to the next level. And one of the lyrics in the song that kind of stuck out to me is why uh, I ended up naming the movie Chasing the Sun. And it's kind of implying the idea of always chasing after a brighter future, and that relentless pursuit of one's dream. And I think that embodies Arlo in this movie, and that embodies the Dare to Leap spirit. To me, Dare to Leap means anytime you're taking a chance or stepping into the unknown or exposing yourself, and that feeling can be so scary when you first do it, but all the worthwhile things that we want come from that moment. You, know, you need to get through that fear to get to a better place.